standing here with world-class champion bodybuilder Gary Stridham, who still looks like he could probably get up on a stage and do some damage uh, these days. Are you 50 yet? Uh, 50 plus. How old are you these days? 54. You are 54. Yeah. You look younger now than you did when you competed. Well, yeah, when you diet and stuff, you look tired, you know? <laughs> you got to run around for the IFBB all the time, you know what I'm right. saying? But uh, no, no, it's just a good, just about lifestyle, you know, just living a life, being healthy and fit. I hear you were living in Thailand these days, just chilling out. Is that true? Or is that a rumor? That's true, but I live where I want to live, you know, that's life. If you take your path and you do what you want to do in life, which very few people really do in life, you know. So, yeah, I'm living in Thailand and uh, I'm always available, you know, for whatever it be, bodybuilding. You're, or, you're one of the, you were these guys, one of these guys that always was doing something. You had California crazy, you had clothing, you competed, you were ultra intense. What do you do with yourself all day? You don't get bored? No, not at all. I mean, you know, you know, there's so many things to do in Thailand. Well, you know, there's a lot of beautiful women there, Gary. Exactly. <laughs> they take up a lot of time, oh, along with do. training and uh, there's other. I've got a few other projects in the in the pipeline as well. You know, a few things with clothing and well, a new so, supplement I know you, line. And oh, you new, do? Oh yeah, I've got a few little things. What's coming. it going to be called? Any uh, any it's gonna, ideas? It's going to be Stratech. It's going to be the new okay. new line. And then um, I'm also co-sponsoring with another line. I'll be signing with a another supplement line and then also we've got the clothing coming what clothing is it what is it going to be well, called it was it's initially was uh crazy wear which was my line right you sold that though right? i sold that and that's you know that's by the wayside it's old-fashioned old school now so we're going for more like uh street wear stuff like that t-shirts you're going mainstream yeah t-shirts jeans some gym wear active wear will it be available in the united states it will be certainly you might have to you might have to go back to the u.s and leave thailand and that will never happen. No, it won't happen. No, no, that will never happen. I'm where I'm supposed to be. And Why do you like it there? Just explain to me. Maybe I'm missing something. Well, you know, when you get when you get to the east, then you really really realize what's going on in the west. You know, I mean, a lot of people in the west they live in the matrix. You know, they right. they live beyond their means and they live for houses and cars and stuff like that. Whereas in Asia, you live for happiness. You know, and tranquility and you know, just environment. You know, the whole environment is more relaxed. Right. You know. Well, you had the, you lived the lifestyle. You were in Venice. I remember you had that apartment above Powerhouse Gym. You were living the lifestyle. I don't think you ever cooked a meal for yourself. Um, do you? Well, look I definitely don't cook meals for myself that. now. So I got my own chef, my driver. You know, I mean, you can really live large in Thailand. Right, you know? but I'm saying, but you you seem to be more at peace. Like the material stuff doesn't matter to you anymore. Material stuff that certainly doesn't matter anymore. That's when you go to really realize that you've got to let go of things in life, you know? Isn't it ironic though, you have to become rich to realize the money doesn't matter? Well, yeah, you have to, you know, you have to find uh, your calling, you have to find what's your peace. Do you know that every trophy that I have had one I've given away? Did you really? I haven't got one. I gave them all away too. Yeah. So I try to get rid of everything. Yeah. I try to get it. I, even my furniture. <laughs> you I give it all away? Everything. I gave it away. That's great. Don't you feel so unburdened I when you do that? I'm burdened because, uh, you know, like, when you're in the West, you always got something that's on your, like, mind as far as a bill or something right. like this. And then you start living in this matrix where you start living for the what how everyone else is living around you you know and this is the you don't do this in asia i feel peaceful just day, talking to gary gary day, give us a double bicep shot 54 years old that's pretty damn great you don't want to compete anymore do you yeah i do you do yeah sure i'm not done you're not done oh i'm not done when are you gonna make this comeback well i can't really tell you that one oh, either boy. It's soon, though. Stridem is not done. You heard it here first on rxmuscle.com. You'll see. He'll be back. Remember, I had a 10-year layoff, so now it's only six. This is easy. Yeah, you, you did make a successful comeback after 10 years. It wasn't bad, huh? For first time back after 10 years on stage. I, I was shocked. <laughs> I heard you hired a posing coach, though. Yeah, I got more than that. <laughs> I got somebody to hold the poses as well. <laughs> what are you going to be weighing, do you think, on stage? Not sure. Not sure. But I just go for a look. You know, I'm not going to be bloated up or no. No. You know, yeah, I'm not going to be. And we're not talking Masters Olympia. Are we talking open? Open. All right, you heard it. No, no more needs to be said. A legend, Gary Strider. Masters is not a Masters. As far as I'm concerned, that's not a Masters. That's just another pro show. Okay, really speaking, that's not a Masters. You're right. So... 
The next show that I'm in is open. That's how I'm considering it.